over the generations, humans have forgotten that math even exists due to the actions of an evil force that changes human thinking patterns. I continue to travel through the computer network, waiting for a hero to lead an overthrow of the robots to liberate the people. As always, I hope that day is today. Should we wait for him? Nah, he's been playing with that thing forever. I'm not gonna be late because of him. This thing's been standing here as long as I can remember. I can't believe nobody wonders what it is or what it does. How about this one, this one, and this one? It's never done this before. Cool! Perfectly? Excellent. Let's begin. Begin what? Who's talking? Welcome to the Blaster Corps. Congratulations, you have been qualified for membership in our elite band of interspace peacekeepers. Our mission, make the galaxy safe. You'll use your Graviton boots to jump higher, your space cycle to fly faster, and your shield to absorb zaps from bad guys of all types. And of course, your holographic blaster hand emits energy bursts, capable of temporarily disabling almost any kind of nasty thing you may come across. And never forget your most important weapon, your brain. It is your proven skill and intellect that makes you a proud member of the Blaster Corps. All right, I'm a blaster. What do I do now? I am so glad you're finally here. My name is Amy. I am here to help you. Are you a blaster too? No, I'm Amy, which stands for... Where are you? I travel throughout... Where did this cool uniform come from? Where are the bad guys? I'll explain everything, but not here, not now. The robots have been alerted to your presence. You are going to have to learn on the fly. Use the left and right arrow keys to run. Press the up arrow to jump. Press the space bar to blast. Grab the orbs to build your answer. Bring your answer to the door and press the enter key when you think you have the right answer. You did even better than I calculated. Those symbols are everywhere, but nobody ever knew what they were. They're like puzzles. Those symbols are called numbers. And now that you have regained your natural ability to do math, you can answer the math puzzles that some very bad robots are using to keep humans from accessing strategic areas throughout the colonies. Oh, that's what those things are. The robots have been keeping humanity under control by suppressing their ability even their will to solve problems or do math. How do you know all this? Are, are you a robot? Oh no, no. My name is Amy. I'm an artificial intelligence program on the Intercolonial Network. I can communicate through almost any terminal, and I am working on arranging assistance for you. I was created to help. Help me do what? Centuries ago, a plan was devised to protect humanity. So what do we have to do to make everything better? Cyclotron X, a powerful robot, had an evil plan to take away everyone's math skills. When he started making his move, I was activated to help stop him. But he was too quick, and his null rays were too powerful. You must have some kind of natural ability or immunity to the null rays. As a result, you were able to reinitiate the protocol when... When I was trying to figure out what the numbers were. Correct. You managed to unlock the blaster terminal and activate the emergency plan. But in activating this long dormant program, Cyclotron X has been alerted to your presence. He and his robots will try to stop you. Stop me? From doing what? Saving humanity. Sounds corny, but that's your mission. I hope you are up to the challenge. Heck yeah, let's do it.
Quickly choose the right answer. Okay, Amy, what's next? There are three human colonies, Earth, Saturn, and Pluto. On each planet, Cyclotron X has constructed a massive generator which emits null rays, suppressing people's math skills. So we have to take out the null generators? Each null generator is protected by several levels of defense. Because of the way the generators are connected, we have to disable the first layer on all three planets before we can start on the second layer. Otherwise, an electrostatic discharge over the whole system could make it too dangerous for us to complete the mission. So where do we start? We'll start with the force shields. I'll calculate the best way to disable the shield generators. You need to get to the control room. I'll show you which way to go, but you'll need to continue unlocking doors with the puzzle orbs as you go. Everything is solved by math? This is gonna be easy. One moment, Blaster. It's going to get tougher as you travel. Your blaster uniform will shield you from more powerful null rays, but you're going to have to make smart, quick decisions on your own. Cyclotron's robots have located us. You need to move, now. All right, Amy, I'm out of here.
You must be Blaster! A girl named Amy contacted me and told me you'd be coming. I don't mind telling you, this all makes me very worried. I can help you shut down the force field, but there are chamber robots in the control room that'll try to stop me from doing it. And I don't do robots. Chamber robots? I haven't seen those. They're pretty dangerous, but Amy says you know the secret of those odd symbols on the robots and something called math. If you can distract the robots long enough, I may be able to manage to work the machinery to power the grid down. But they're gonna come after me if you mess up. I'll project my shield onto you. That should protect you long enough for me to shut it down. Let's do it. This will be fun. If you say so.
my gosh! I can't believe I... I mean, we did it! We actually did it! One down, two to go. Blaster, there's a space cycle launch pad just below the control room you can use. I can't wait to get to Saturn. Let's do it! Sweet! What is this? A Blaster space cycle launch pad. Let me show you a clip. Space Cycles and you. Welcome, Agent of the Blaster Corps. These Space Cycles will allow you to get where you're going in a hurry. Whether it's to the other side of the colony or to another planet in the solar system. But remember, zipping through space is no laughing matter. Space debris, radiation, even a basic lack of oxygen can all cut your journey short. But you will be protected if you enter correct Blaster Corps codes. By arranging the charged ionic energy globes on the console to form correct mathematical equations, you will activate the Space Cycle's life support, force field, and launch engine. But be careful. These power globes can be unstable. Pressing the done button with incorrect equations on the grid will be hazardous to your health. Ouch! Sorry, Charlie. So be smart, be careful, and enjoy your ride. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Use the mouse to move the numbered energy globes to make complete equations. Press the done button when all the equations are correct. The space cycle is activated. All right, then let's go.
I'm monitoring the security robot network. I'm almost ready. I never knew there was this much on Saturn. It's amazing! This was once the agricultural center of the solar system. Back when humans started colonizing the other parts of the solar system, scientists found that the soil and atmosphere of this moon accelerate healthy plant growth. So engineers terraformed the moon to enhance agriculture. They even designed these elevated platforms to create more level ground available to grow crops. Now there's a lot of space wreckage and only enough resources to barely take care of the local population. Can we repair the system? Yes, but you've got a force shield to disable first. You better get going. I'm showing security robots are aware of your presence.
Here's the launch pad. Okay, let's enter the codes.
There he is! The Pluto Mountain! Just like the speaker said. Are you sure you want to help? Amy told me that if we shut down the force field around the null generator, she'd help me make some robot parts into a gnarly hoverboard. I'm not passing up that opportunity. Do you know what to do? Absolutely, Melon. No worries. You keep the security robot distracted. I'll take care of the force shield. I think I can manage that. Let's do it. Yeah. So radical. Life is going to so change. The force shield is so disabled. Yes! Another force shield bites the dust. There's still one to go on Earth, Blaster. There's another space cycle launch pad below the control room. You need to get there fast. Okay, Amy. Consider me there.
Earth. So this is where my colony comes from. Originally, yes, before the invention of space travel. This looks even easier than the last two places. I don't see as many robots. Don't be fooled. The security here is trickier, and there are new math challenges to face. More importantly, nothing happens from the most complex calculations to a bus timetable without Cyclotron knowing about it. Where exactly is he? No human, machine, or program knows. He has upgraded himself so much over the centuries that there isn't a being who knows what he looks like. This will be the easiest place for Cyclotron to stop you. You've got to keep focused on shutting down the force field, and you've got to hurry. All right. Wish me luck, Amy. I'm on my way.
here's the launch pad. Okay, let's enter the codes. Use the mouse to move the numbered energy globes and symbol pieces to make complete equations. Press the done button when all equations are correct. Not all globes will be needed to initiate the power up sequence.
Hello, hello, hello. Here he is, the plaster himself. That's Blaster. Of course it is. Look, great to meet you. Hey, might want to shake your other hand if you know what I mean. I mean, with all that pulsing energy and all. Can I just say, Amy told me all about you. And it is, well, an honor. An honor to be working alongside you. Thank you. Will you be able to help? You use those crazy skills of yours I heard about to keep the security robot busy. And I'll take care of the force shield. No problem. No problem at all. Okay, then. Let's go. I'm on it, Flaster. Amazing! Astounding! Stupendous! I'm at a loss for words. It's a great team effort. Very well done, Blaster. That takes care of all of Cyclotron's force shields. There's a space cycle just outside the control room. Fly up to the power satellite and we'll power up for the long-range trip back to Pluto. Finally something easy. Let's do it! Good luck, Blaster!
Okay, that was easy enough. I'm on the satellite now. So where is... Uh-oh. Well, you may think yourself awful clever disabling my force shield, but that's all you're going to accomplish. You and Amy have no idea of the brilliance you're pitting yourselves against. There's a tractor beam that keeps anything from leaving this satellite, and the odds of getting past the security arms to disable it are 23 million, 303 to 1. Oh, really? Maybe with that big eye of yours, you'll get a great view of my bike when I blast off this hunk of junk. Bring it on. Use the mouse to quickly choose the right answers before they disappear.
think the Blaster Core is going to flourish. But there's only one of you, and you can't compete with my vastly superior intellect. Furthermore, I've calculated that none of your actions will have any bearing on my master plan, which actually is in place because of you. Blaster, I think now would be a good time to fly away before he reactivates the tractor beam and you get stuck here again. No arguments here. You and Amy won't beat me again. I can promise you that. That was close. You've done great, Blaster. But there's still a lot to do. Let's get back to Pluto and move to the next phase. I'm with you. I want to get as far from Cyclotron as we can. For now.